Good morning, everybody. This is John and so on, and oh, oh, we're building a Lego house. Uh, I am from the desk, from the journal of Randall, Randall William Carter, oh, Randall, Randolph Warren Carter, sorry. Oh, from the journal of Randolph Warren Carter, there it says, um, I'm doing, since I've got the capability of doing a face cam, I might as well do it. And I don't have proper lighting in this room, so you're going to enjoy mood lighting. So just, well, I, it's not, I'm not professional yet anyway, but let's get right into it. And I well, swear, everything I'm about you. to tell you is true okay. from my own experiences and from the journal of Randolph Warren Carter. Ah, so you are not, Randolph. Okay, just so that the portrait's head is barely visible. Let's see here. There we go. And there is a word down there that I can't see. What do I do now? Just enter. Three times I knocked and received no answer. A little louder, please. I stared deeply at the ancient open door that stood before me. Okay. then you might as well go home. Have some tea, you know, coffee. Take a nap. had sat upon a decrepit porch, covered in dirt and leaves, yet it lacked a single footprint. It looks like it's floating out in Neverland. No man had entered or left that house in some amount of weeks, perhaps even months. No. I've got ten minutes. Eight now. Did this man who I had never met what a glorious thing it would have been to simply drive off and remain ignorant to the ongoing that accursed abode. So how are you guys doing? Yes, my uncle's letter to me. That's good. That's good. I'm doing better now. Oh! To my dear grandnephew George. I realize we have never met and that I have never truly been a part of your family. That's an error right there. These, sorry, these monthly letters may be a nuisance, yet I hope you aren't ignoring my simple plea. What is that? I do not have much time left in this world, and I am in dire need of an executor to take care of my, the many things which I will leave behind. Please travel to my home so that we may speak in person. I fear the most dire of consequences if our meeting does not happen soon. This, so, so please, I beg of you, send some response to relieve this lonely old man of his despair. With love, Randolph Carter. Press space to continue. Well, I mean, he's already losing his mind. Press space to continue. But, uh, I guess I'm an executor, then? George's? I held my breath. Yep. I pulled the door open wide and surrounded myself in the darkness. Well, geez. Could just go get a flashlight or something. Or, you know. Use the arrow keys to move left and right. Press space to interact with objects. Press F to turn off and on. Read notes and venture further into the house. Use up and down to change flashlight angle. Okay. Damn, it's dark in here. Good thing I brought my flashlight. <laughs> well, that's some, uh, I is it going to run out of batteries? This is a nice, this is a nicely painted portrait. Yes. It's probably what ominous looking temple. Ah, what? Uh, the batteries ran out. Seriously? It looks like a note. It looks like a note. But I can't read it without my flashlight working. The batteries ran out in five it's seconds. Similar. But I shouldn't go up there yet. Not until I fix my flashlight. I'm gonna die. It looks like a note, but I can't read it without my flashlight working. Did do, 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 do. Look, batteries. It looks like a note. Okay, how can you see the batteries though? Oh, hey there. How you doing? Um, thank you. I am not reading that. You must go upstairs to my study and find a peculiar book. The Necronomicon page of the Perkin incantation is marked, yet never spoken aloud, not unless the time is right. On the, first, on the first of every month, you must travel to the basement, book in hand, and speak to the... Do not venture into the attic. I, I'm supposed to do all this? Can I... Can I continue? 
Hello? Seriously? So this is what has become of my uncle. Oh, dear God. So this is what has become of my uncle. Oh, the smell. He's been dead for weeks. So I'm gonna have to, like... Can I... Can I read the bloody paper? I thought this would be a great experience, but it... Okay, never mind. This door is locked. This door is locked. Better not run out of... Oh, uh, no. Oh, look, it's another bot. Oh, okay. It's a coat hanger or something. Better not run out of batteries in five minutes or... Can I read the bloody paper? Okay. No more instructions. Fine. Okay, it sounded kind of terrible. These plants have been dead for weeks. I suppose that makes sense, though. This portrait must be of my great aunt. Wow, she was beautiful. Oh. This what a load of... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, good. Book with, um, skull on it. Okay, let's, um, skedaddle. Why does it sound like he's going <laughs> Every time he goes up and down stairs. I just, I just left this room. Uh, did you? Because I thought I just went into it. Okay, whatever you say, buddy. Hey, uncle. Eww. You wanna... Okay. I'm sorry, every time you break your... Yeah, okay. Every time you break your neck, I'm sorry for that. Alright, never mind, we won't be reading the note. Nothing. There was nothing there. Okay. More dialogue. And I gotta go down there. What he wanted me for. The incantations in the book I found. They were necessary to prevent this horror from being released. I'm gonna I was try and late in my response. A month had passed since the incantation was last spoken, and my uncle had hung himself in madness. And so I flipped through the pages of that eldritch manual, memorizing every word, and frightfully I waited in the darkness. You did that fast. I mean, it's a, it's a book. Okay. What? What? Okay. Hey, we needed a short video. So, um, yeah, that was a thing. Wasn't very good. I liked Maurice much better. At least it had an... <laughs> Don't worry about that. Anyways, I'm almost out of time, and this is great. I've never not had to do two parts. So, thanks everybody for watching. I really felt like doing a horror game. I forgot to mention that. And I should be doing more in the future, because I enjoyed this. Sort of. So, thanks everybody for watching, and good night!